Today we're talking about the shoulders and particularly overhead pressing with bilateral unilateral pairing for isometric and uh, progressive calisthenics as well. So we've got our iso trainer and again you can use yoga straps or a suspension trainer. Gymnastics rings work well for this as well. So you're going to stand on the actual straps. And you're going to adjust the height so that they're about 90 degrees ish or so. If it's a little higher or lower is perfectly fine. I don't recommend having the arms all the way out to the side. Have them in just a little tiny bit. It's easier on the shoulder joint, but do make sure your shoulders are packed down and back. Drive up, but don't jerk because that's hard on the joints. Give yourself about a second or so to assess the tension and drive. Just like you're trying to reach your arms up as high as you can and then release. Take a couple deep breaths and drive yet again. There's your isometric. For your dynamic, we have wall walking, and this can be either going up a wall or across a wall, whichever you like, but basically you're crawling yourself up into a handstand position, making sure that you're crawling with your hands and your feet as high as you're comfortable with. The higher you go, the more resistance will be on your arms. Pause for a second or two, and then crawl yourself back down under control. We're supersetting these for a total of three rounds. So you have the isometric overhead press holding for a total of 20 seconds. Then go and do the crawling up the wall or across the wall, however you see fit. Let you play around with that one. Go as high as you can or as long as you can for about one set. It'll probably take you about 15 seconds or so, always maintaining control and breathing smoothly during that set. Thanks again for watching. Thoughts, comments, and questions down below. And tomorrow I'll be coming to you with an isometric dynamic pairing for your abdominals. Till then, be fit, live free.